going to cover a mistake I found not in my breadboarding of this circuit, which is a revised uh, uh, drawing of the original circuit, um, but actually a problem with the sound system in an HP computer, which I was using. Uh, I also had this schematic, uh, which is the same as the one you just saw, but just laid out a little bit clearer uh, to see. I do not have the isolation diode or the 100 microfarad lab box has that already in there. You'll notice I have three green capacitors. Uh, those are in series, so I get a point uh, zero, uh, 0.03, and I have four resistors at the top, so I get a 5.2K, uh, perfect uh, within 5% or better. So uh, the breadboarding uh, was laid out was exactly the same as the schematic. However, the sound card in the HP computer in inverts the uh, the audio, which is a mistake, and I don't understand how HP could have done uh, production like that. But I went to three other clone computers that I built, and they all came out with the same test, 97% uh, duty cycle, instead of the incorrect 3% that was shown with the HP computer. Now, why I'm doing this circuit, and a lot of people don't understand what, what the purpose is, uh, Rosemary Allison's circuit uh, is, is much, the, the operation is I think much the same as what I found using the David Lawton modified circuit. And this is an excellent uh, forum to go to. Uh, look at that uh, address uh, at the top. That's a 75 page forum article. You're going to find it very interesting. And they do have an up to date schematic just posted in the last few days. Uh, and it conforms a lot closer to what I'm doing. Gone is the 24 volt uh, battery and now it's a 12 volt system self-contained. Now this is my modification of the David Lawton circuit and you only need 1555. Uh, uh, all my tests were done with a duty cycle of 50 percent. But I did add a very important, actually two important uh, uh, controls to this circuit. One is the uh, level control and the other is the bias control and this is really important to get the the MOSFET to act to produce this reduced current. Uh, my whole purpose is I needed a way to hook a device into a 12 volt automobile circuit and get between two and a half and three and a half volts of high current to my cell. This is my original prototype on the right is the MOSFET uh, heat sink directly to the aluminum, no insulation. On the left is the you know, Shockley diode or Damfast diode which I replaced in circuit. This, is a, this has a much better effect. This is one of my test cells that I've used for almost a year. I've kept no secret on how this is made. Uh, I'm going to show you the interior. It's a, it's a uh, two accelerator grid. The outside stainless steel is negative. The, the first accelerator, the accelerator grid is positive and the third is negative. So we have the two negatives paralleled in there, and it's very simple. Now you're looking at a, almost a year's use. Do you see any uh, discoloration? Uh, that's 304 stainless steel screen. It's a very cheap quality screen, yet it costs a lot of money to buy. Okay, now when we're running this, the cell current, this is a series circuit. The cell current is around 7.9 amps when we cool the rod. Uh, it does cost you about 9 tenths of an amp for the, for the fan, it amps out of, of the circuit. And the beauty part of it is that even though we have uh, in the cell circuit, we're only drawing less than 4 amps out of the power supply. So I'm producing as more true HHO running at 3 volts than people are running their systems at 12. Once you give above about that 3 volt level, you're just producing steam. You're not producing any more gas, but it appears that you are. Here is a simplified version of the circuit, uh, and basically you're just showing an input for the square wave on the left. Uh, there's the three meter readings. The top one is the current from the uh, power supply. The, the middle one is the voltage across the cell, and the bottom is the uh, actual cell current draw. So it's better than a two to one. Uh, there's an attached video from Germany on one of my videos that he's achieved even more uh, current reduction. So that's really why I wanted to try uh, her circuit to see if I can improve on the basic one I've been using.